Hey guys, old folks here. So Throne Wars ended, and I really hadn't planned this coming to a new server, but I'm I'm king. Uh, <laughs> I'm very honored. Uh, again, not something I fought for, but they uh, they gave to me because of my contribution to the alliance. So I'm very appreciative. For those of you that haven't watched my other videos, um, I'll go over it a little bit real quick. So basically, ruler statuses. You can change these all every day. It really doesn't matter. But basically, you can choose um, when you want the monster chest rate to drop uh, a little extra. Uh, I set it for the 5 to 9 because that's when we're usually on. Uh, I also declare that iron mines, uh, actually silver mines, will give an 8% um, production increase. These will take effect at uh, server restart time tomorrow. I also can choose on every Sunday a certain stage will drop double rune. So the current hero that I always choose is Merlin because everybody wants Merlin. And I always choose the Elite 5-7 so the majority of people can get that. Um, if you want to be a jerk, you can set it for the high one. And there's nothing people can do about it. But I'm not like that. Uh, Alliance Gifts, I've gone ahead and I've given out... Um, as they were decided by the uh, Alliance members. Uh, the advantage we have here is ours go to all of our Alliance members because there is no um, unions at this time. So I'm looking for my last person here. Where are they? This is the worst part. I had a huge list I wrote down. Um, that was really fast. I don't think I saw them. And you have to scroll through them. There they are. All right. Click confirm. And that gave it out successfully. And finally, um, you know, so these people all got all of this. They got all those. They got all those. Um, and then finally, we we're out to the last part. So here, um, basically, I've given out everything. So anybody else that's left gets the bronze. Which, you know, it's still... Nothing to, la uh, nothing to say, you know, oh, I didn't get anything else. It's free diamonds. It's uh, free honor. It's uh, free um, resources. As king, the hardest part is giving out all the rewards. I'm not going to lie. Um, we're going to go here. I'm almost done. Do do. Do do. Do do. Do do do. Can't click a box. Can't click a box. That's it. Confirm. Okay. And there's one left because we have one position left. And I'm done on that part. So all that's done, all that's been given out. As the ruler, this is the gift that you get. You get an increase to your uh, regen speed, your capacity, your city wall max. You get bonuses to your tech. Uh, I can mute people. I get a blue... Uh, chat logo and I have a castle. I haven't popped the castle yet because of where I'm sitting You want to be able to see it Participation rewards if you um, did anything in it. You should have earned some I already collected. It, it wasn't much um, This just kind of brings you back to here shows you. Hey, this is what takes place um, Unions again, no unions until next time when they open up uh, Whoever creates the union is the one that gets to choose who the king is um, So just kind of know about that if you want, you can use the brand new flag for the Alliance. Most of us don't. Past rulers, obviously, I'm in the office. I'm the first one, so nothing else there. And that's it. The only other thing left is appointing statuses. Now, these are highly valued, highly sought after statuses because of the effects that they have. The ones down below, which are the commoners, are a little less. But, like, a lot of people really want the sage one um, because it in increases your tech time by basically 8% or decreases it sorry so if it's going to take you know I'm going to be terrible in math here I'm just going to round off if it takes 100 hours at 10% obviously it would only take 90 so here it takes 92 hours so it saves you 8 hours which may not seem like a lot but when you're really pumping through it it's uh, it's pretty huge um, when you want to assign it to somebody you have two options you can either choose from the list here which uh, is very easy to do. The other thing I like to do, especially when discussing with our um, friends like, you know, here, where I'm like, man, I, I'm going to have a hard time if i got a lot of Chinese friends, is I just click copy. 
and then I come back here I uh, choose a point status I'm just gonna say paste and then now when I click confirm it would give this to them um, when you give someone a, a status they cannot change it for 48 hours they are that for 48 hours so you can't take it off after that you can rotate the statuses through um, I think after four days it automatically kicks them out um, down here from these so I hope that helps uh, I'm excited uh, I honestly, I mean, never anticipated being king once. Definitely never anticipated being king twice. Uh, people that know me, I'm, I'm really kind of a an easy laid back guy. So um, hopefully that kind of helps you. Um, everything else, like you can see here right now, I've got a little thing by my, my name and my stuff's here. So that's it, guys. I hope this helps you some with the kingly duties and what you do. Um, obviously it makes it easier uh, for the next time you have a throne wars you can use some of those statuses um, without getting too deep but uh, you can use some of these statuses to to make it easier or, or harder on the people you're fighting that you don't want to be it so basically I, I decrease their max amount of walls so they're easier to destroy um, I lower their tech levels um, I and cost they make their marching speed um, take longer uh, so there's things you can do you know how much protected is decreased um, so there's lots of stuff you know um, that you can do to people so thanks for watching guys I hope you have a great day and uh, signing off as the king again have a great one